update that, and then you go in here for the names, like, obviously, uh, in prison on the right. Although they're sitting differently wherever their player is. Okay. Because it'll line up with their portrait on the bottom. Mm -hmm. Three, two, so right here, and then go. broken. Here you go. So you just you add the names, mm -hmm. and then you click update, and then you watch. Okay. But in between games, you just click CSS or character select screen. Okay. On the left over here. All right. And it'll do the transition like that in between matches. Oh, okay. Yeah, if you want. Yeah. They just do it to make it look nice. But, uh, Tom versus Wolf. Yeah, I was gonna say, typically I know, uh, you don't see them play too often, but I'm pretty sure Token usually beats them. Mm -hmm. I've seen them play too often, so. Okay. I mean, Imprison is definitely getting better than playing him recently. I love when he does that. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Down. He's fucking bumps to the wall right now. Yeah, to be honest, yeah. something that I've been telling a lot of people here and, you know, my brother, whoever else I play a lot, I'm just like, hey, if you tilt your shield in your corner like that, oh, great kill. If you tilt your shield against multi-hits or anything frustrating in the corner and you can't move, mm -hmm. at least you'll have the extra distance because there's a little secret people don't talk about, but if you actually tilt your shield, your parry window stays where your shield initially was without tilting. Oh, so okay. you actually get more area of defense. That was a great kill. <laughs> but yeah, it's just a little thing people don't really use often. Yeah. Because if you hold both shield buttons or like shield and B, you can start moving. This ledge pressure has been getting a lot stronger on Broken's part. Oh my god, that counter. He's gotta do he's gonna do some more upbees at the ledge. I feel like he he tries to push it a bit. Yeah, whenever you get very predictable, I mean he just sees him constantly going for the yeah. side beast and now he can just snap. Snap it. Yeah. yeah. Like if that doesn't snap, but up he does. So at least with up B, you know, you don't get the same horizontal, but your vertical's a tiny bit higher, so. You just wait a little bit and update. Oh, Good it. luck. <laughs> wow. Two stock on that. I started off pretty even too. Training paid off. I'm curious to see where they'll go next. All right, man. So Kroken. Oh, Josh. Kro yeah, yeah, Josh. Kroken. Josh versus Drew here. I'm guessing Josh took game one. He took game one, but in the beginning it was very close. He actually was doing great. Yeah. Great, yeah. So did Drew counterpick this? Uh, they started here. Yeah, so I have no idea. I think he just likes the stage. I mean, it's good for Wolf. He has that extra distance. See, the platforms are great for extensions of up airs and throws. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's not like either of them really have a disadvantage here, I don't think. Yeah. But he's getting pinned down in the corner really hard. Oh like, my right God. there. Crom's such a heavy hitter and so aggressive, so it's like... If, the if Krom... you show any signs, you know... Find that weakness and just explode it. Yeah, like so spot aggressive. dodges or rolls, like you're... Josh, he's really good at reading rolls in. Like, yeah. he knows when the combo will extend, it won't extend. So if it doesn't extend, he'll like, kind of wait to see what you're going to do. If you, you know, if you're getting common, just something to spam air dodge or well, whatever happens. Well, spot dodges too. Spot dodge... In this game, is like the air dodge in Smash 4. People spam it yeah. because they oh, know yeah. it's super safe. But when you spam something that's super safe, eventually they'll notice. I mean, yeah, it's only so safe. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, there's, it, there's only so much you can do. It's like, yeah. That's like, like the new number one bad habit thing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. And it, sometimes it can be tough for Wolf, I feel like, recovering. Like, if side beats, 
Well, yeah, exactly. If you have like side B's, Krom's like super one of the fastest characters, so like side B's, Krom can catch right up, grab, or dash attack. And the worst part is like Krom doesn't really have the greatest edge guarding. Same with Roy, obviously, but they can't go their off. ledge trap? Ridiculous. Yes, the, ed yeah. the edge guarding itself, you know, they obviously have pretty non big recoveries, so it's hard for them to go super far off stage, but if they stay right where you're gonna roll up or read your jumps or whatever, that's super, super good. Yeah, they can do that shield tactic where they sit there and jab different distance. Mm -hmm. Just hold shield, jab, hold shield up, you do whatever, yeah. and you're going off the stage or you're dying to a confirm. I mean, this is ridiculous. Like, you can hold shield and wait like you did there. Mm. He's going to get the mix ups, and you know, Crokin recently has been really polishing up on that. But Drew is also like, his neutral has been improving so much. Yeah, takes, I agree. He takes a lot more time. You can see Drew's been. Yeah. He plays so much. Uh, a little play sessions that we have during the week when it's not this. Yeah, you like just stay up until people leave. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I played yesterday for a while. They do nice. Yeah. yeah. And Josh is Josh put a lot of Smash 4 too. You know what I mean? So he's been. Yeah, you can tell his fundamentals are pretty strong. Yeah. Yeah. I exactly. think that um, I don't know how this matchup plays out, but either do once I, either of them, it looks like it's fairly even. It just looks like uh, looks like Drew's having a hard time getting at a disadvantage, like you mentioned. And his recoveries with side here are a bit predictable. But, oh, yeah. but if he just like waits a tiny bit longer, up piece, he can snap ledge every time, and Krom can't really do too much. Like he has to wait for Wolf to get up the really Yeah, attack. like you said, yeah. uh, ledge trap is like, exactly all right. Mm -hmm. Kind of it's, I think this matchup is kind of whoever just gets in, you know, it's just both pretty the neutral's nice. Whoever pretty plays yeah, the neutral solid. better. Yeah. Well, I mean, that's what it all, almost like, it all comes down to. Yeah, but that was a great read. Even. That was a great read. Great up smash. That was clean. I think I've been telling him so many times. Oh, is that Jeff? No, oh, great DI almost. on that. Yeah. 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 Oh my god, Rar Bear? Rar. Dude, that was crazy. Came right at him. That was almost instantaneous. I'm so glad I got that. I've changed though, because I've been telling him. You want to smash out uh, shields? Dude, really good on wall. This is gonna yeah. sound like not dumb, but it's like, dude, 